Hey guys, how are you doing? I hope you're all well. Let's sing a song full of hope, full of pain. Why don't you sing along, my friend? For it's our last refrain. Forever young, never strong. Harry, we're ready for our birthday. Memories like this never end. No, they don't fade away. So when I'm gone, oh, when I'm gone, I'll be right there. It's you for you. I can't wait to show you what I've got in this box. I've basically got my close friends on instagram so i'm sure most of you know what a close friend story is but if not then it's basically something you can have on instagram where you can just put like a private story up for people who are close your close friends in life so i popped on my close friend story asking if they could pick me out some things to buy off amazon and i have this huge box that has arrived on prime filled with loads of amazing goodies from a load of my close friends on instagram so i'm gonna open them share who got me each thing and we're gonna have a good time i feel like there's some good things in here so let's go okay so first thing i've got is from one of my friends dave i'm gonna pop prices on the screen so you can see how much each item is and i'm gonna leave some links below in case anyone's interested in any of these things luckily most of my close friends have done me good got me things that are useful or something that they think I'm going to enjoy. I don't think I've had many people be horrible to me in this haul. So I'm quite happy about that. And a lot of these things in here are really good gift ideas. With like Christmas sort of on the horizon now. And like just for birthdays and things. If you're needing some good gift inspo. There's actually quite a lot of things in here that would be like perfect. So anyway. First things first. This is from my friend Dave Annika. He's done me so nice here. By getting me one of these sunset lamps. I've got one of the night lamps that I got from Wish. Um, but this one looks so cool. It's literally all over TikTok like a couple of months ago. So I'm definitely late to the trend. Let me get it out. Should I see if I can plug it in to show you? I'm going to try and use as many of these things as possible to show you guys what they're like. I feel like this isn't too hard to put together. So for some reason, I thought it was going to come bigger. But it might actually be quite nice being like minimal and quite sleek. It comes with a little remote so we can um, change the colour of the lights. It's literally just like a three-piece set that screws together. So you've got the base the stand and then the actual light on top and then it comes with like a usb so i've got a little usb thing down here i'm gonna pop it in oh i'm actually really excited like to see if this is gonna work oh <gasps> wow okay oh <gasps> this is so sick can you see that let me right i'm gonna close my curtain so we can see all of these settings and stuff but on the front it does say that it has one light four colors we've got rainbow blue sun sunset sunset red it says it's four colours, but I've got like a whole remote here. I'm so confused. What does that mean? Close the curtains a bit. It's like the middle of the day, so it probably won't be the best that it ever will be. Wow. Blue. Oh, wow. This is so sick. I actually love that. Like, how cool. This will be actually really sick for parties as well, because you can use them like little flash and strobe. Like the remote I have for my night one is very similar. Or like if you have them LED strip lights that go around your room, like I think they're quite similar. Like you can flash, make it flash. Gonna use this for parties, way! Right, I'm well impressed with that. That is gonna keep me very, very occupied and probably gonna make me procrastinate after this video. So thanks, Dave. I actually really, really love that. I feel like I'm gonna get a lot of use out of that, especially, let me open my thing again so we've got some light. Um, but I do actually think that's gonna be really useful for like content creation and stuff with my job and also just really cool for like social parties and things like that. It's 10 out of 10, Dave. I don't even think that was that pricey either. Like, I think I feel like it was a bargain. Okay, so next present is very, very practical from my lovely friend Chloe, styled by Chloe on Instagram. She has provided me with a link to this Philips um, fabric shaver. I don't have anything like this because I am literally shit at adult life. Like, I'm actually so bad at getting things that are useful for adult life. Like, I just don't want to grow up. So Chloe's forced me into growing up by getting a fabric shaver. I feel like this is uh, going up in the adult world and growing up. Super useful, something I don't own. Gonna come in handy. Thanks, Chloe. So next thing I have is from my good old friend, Hattie. She was in all of the, of the uni vlogs. I lived with her at uni, if you guys remember her. So Hattie has actually hooked me up. This is very her. She is a massive lover of reading and everything. So she has really good book recommendations. And she has hooked me up with this book called The Serial Killer's Wife by Alice Hunter. I really wanna get back into like reading, having some downtime. I'm hopefully gonna be booking 
some holidays in the horizon so I need some books to take away with me so we can actually really relax stop looking at a screen every single second of the day so I'm buzzing about this and serial killers anything like that true crime fictional crime it's just a bit of me like mystery killer vibe I love so I'm gonna definitely be reading this on my next trip or in the evening so I can't wait to let you guys know how it goes I'm currently reading um a book called everybody by olivia lang i spoke about on my instagram i'd highly recommend it if you're looking for uh, a good non-fiction book to read all about like body acceptance and how the freedom of our bodies has been oppressed in so many different ways sexual rights and everything like that is like such an interesting book so that's my book recommendation at the moment i'm almost finished it now jess hickey has come through my good old friend jess hickey she is an absolute babe one of my favorite people to follow online such a positive spirit i have i've had the pleasure of meeting her this year and she is just like one of the most genuine kindest souls in the whole world she does tiktok and instagram you need to follow her if you don't already but she has been an absolute babe she has no idea that i am literally the most forgetful person for things like this like if i make myself a hot cup of tea or coffee at home or like when i'm at my family home and my mum or dad has made me a hot tea or coffee i always forget that it's there because i get so distracted like doing work or scrolling through instagram or something that i forget that i have a drink there so she's got me a hot drink warmer you just pop on and it stays stays heated so thank you very much jess for a, a super useful purchase that i actually really need in my life like this is so useful and practical to me <laughs> and i didn't even know they existed i don't know if that's stupid i think when i showed carrie she was like oh it's one of those warmers and i was like i've literally never seen these in my life so um thanks jess for hooking me up it's literally again very sleek compact a nice little size just to pop away in the cupboards when you're not using it the storage in this in the flat that me and carrie are staying in isn't great so anything that's like sleek i'm just like yes we love to see it like it's probably not that deep for most of you guys but um anything that's like small like again that the sunset lamp that um dave got me i was like that is literally perfect it's just sleek small can fit into the room without being like some gigantic lamp so yeah buzzing about that so the next item is from my friend alice thorpe this is what she's picked out for me literally a huge box of like retro sweets i'm actually obsessed like i want to eat everything in here immediately we've got like double dips refreshers wham bars oh my god these were elite like at school parties i would love these so much like like yes please and they'd be like 10p as well oh i actually miss this era of life so much but we've got literally tons of like retro sweets like you know the little like fruit sherbet things fizzers fruit salads i'm gonna have a whale of a time going through these and eating them my boyfriend is going to be very happy as well because he loves sweets thank you alice for bringing me some food in this Amazon order. Oh, i actually want to eat everything right now so we've now got a little order from my friend steph who i met at uni she has sorted me out i'm actually obsessed with these she sorted me out and got me loads of these like claw clips i actually wanted to buy some more because the ones that i have i love them but they are slightly too small and my hair's quite thick the other ones i have aren't holding my hair up that much but these are so much bigger and look like they can fit a lot more hair in and i've got a pack of six and i think it was like super cheap as well and they're really nice colors we've got some like a green blue and yellow if we want to match it to like a brighter outfit or add a pop of color to an outfit and then i've got some like cool neutrals so we've got like a cream a gray and a brown but yeah super useful i didn't even like consider going on amazon and buying things like that but it's actually so useful we love to see it because when if you go into a shop they're like a, a few pounds each do you know what i mean whereas you can get six for a few pounds all of my close friends have actually given me the most useful <laughs> useful things ever um by the way i couldn't physically buy everything that i had on my close friends because it would have been one expensive two the order would have been massive and this video would be way too long. so i had to like prioritize the first people who replied so i'm really sorry if i haven't picked your stuff but this came from my friend megan she has sorted me out with a usb candle lighter. i don't own like a normal lighter or anything i just have like a few little like matches from random things to like my candles so this is going to be super useful and i'm also a little tiny bit tinty tinty bit scared of fire i think it's like come from when i like severely burnt my hand it wasn't even i didn't even burn myself from like fire it was from like a car exhaust so like the heat of like a surface but i just have like a really i'm quite scared of like things that are like really hot so i can avoid getting close to the <laughs> 
close like you would with a lighter by using this little USB candle lighter and I can finally start lighting my candles rather than them just like sitting there looking pretty on my side so I feel like it will definitely be good especially now that it's like coming into autumn like for the cosy autumnal vibes like lighting your candle having like a nice little smell in your room getting all toasty so yeah thank you very much Meg this is like Christmas in a way like I'm just I'm boxing loads of random gifts that other people have picked up for me. My friend Nick he has picked out this nacho cheddar popcorn seasoning. The li probably the most random thing in this order. This is what it looks like. She said, wait, let me, I think she sent me a message actually when she sent this to me. Let me find it. So we have a bit more context. <laughs> oh, she literally just put it's honestly delicious I put it on all sorts so I don't think she limits herself to putting this on popcorn even though that's what it's supposed to be for shall I open it and like have a little taste yeah I'm gonna open it and taste it just on its own which is obviously not the best gonna be the best taster so when it's not actually on something I don't know how I'm feeling about this nacho cheddar popcorn seasoning it's just so random new how did you discover this I would love to know oh it smells very cheesy me and Carrie are definitely gonna have to make something that we put this on or something. Oh my god, what does that taste of? I think this tastes like the Dorito, like you know the dusting on like Dorito crisps. This is what this tastes like on the tangy cheese ones. I am a big fan of this. I don't know what else I'd put it on. I want to know what New puts this on when she says she puts it on all sorts. Like what does she mean by that? I'd love to know. Interesting. It says that it's made with real cheese. Super random, but it tastes delicious. I'm actually so buzzing about this next one. It's from Emily Philpot, and she said that she's bought, I think she said she to me she'd bought a couple for her house. I can't remember if these are outdoor or indoor. It's called a tabletop bioethanol fireplace for indoor or outdoor use. Um, this is what it looks like online. They're $29.99, which I don't think is bad at all for something like this. Wait, let me please focus. $29.99, I don't think it's too bad for something like this. And then I just had to order it with lighter fluid, which I have here. Emily was like, don't forget the lighter fluid. But yeah, we've got our, our very own lighter fluid. It's quite, quite scary, like, I don't know why. Does anyone else find these bottles, like, scary? When they have, like, all of the, like, scary danger symbols on. I think we've figured out from this video that I'm literally, like, a little pussy that um, is scared of fire and growing up. Right, let me put this together and then get back to you one second. Well, I clearly haven't read instructions in a while because that took me way longer than I should have. But um, this is what it looks like. It's not even that difficult to put together. There's literally like five or six parts. Um, and we have like the little fibers in there which you put the fluid on and light and then the stones that go all the way around. I don't really want to put them in right now, um, but I will show you these, I'm sure, in a vlog to come when I've got it all like set up. I don't know whether me and Carrie are going to have it outdoors or indoors at the moment. Probably outdoors. Bring a little bit of light and stuff when we're like chilling on the terrace in the evenings, especially when it's a bit darker. But I absolutely love this. I think this could be like one of my favorite items just because it's so different and I would never have thought to pick something up like this so, yeah thank you very much emily for that i love it okay and then the final couple of things we've got another book this one is from my friend katie knights who i met at uni and she's given me this book called the invisible life of addy larue by ve schwab and i don't actually know what this is about i just thought i'd quickly whack them in my basket and not look too much into any of these items when i was purchasing them let me have a quick read Okay, this sounds very interesting. It's like a fantasy fiction book, which is something that I would never pick up myself because I usually like sort of gravitate more towards like the book I'm currently reading, like non-fiction stuff or stuff like Hattie got me, like the serial killer stuff. So it'll be nice to like step up my comfort zone, but this sounds so interesting. It's set in France in, 19 in 1714. And it's about someone, uh, a girl who's lived 300 years, I believe. The Invisible Life of Addie LaRue is a dazzling adventure across centuries and continents, across history and art about a young woman learning how far she'll go to leave her mark on the world. Yeah, something a little bit different, but I actually think this sounds really up my street. We'll see, I'll let you guys know how I get on with this. Again, something um, nice to take with me if I end up going somewhere this year. And then the final item, potentially the best of last, is from Carrie. And she's picked me us out this, I say us because it'll be in our our flat, um, but it's this jellyfish lamp. Look how cool it looks. We can like change the colours of the little jellyfish. They'll be like bobbing about. I'm gonna open it up and see if we can set it up currently, but if not, you'll be seeing it in the vlogs. Okay, I won't be able to set this up just yet because I need three AA batteries. It looks like in here we've got the little weird like jellyfish <laughs> things that are gonna be floating. I guess I fill this up with some sort of liquid. Or do I? I don't know. Yeah, probably. 
but I will let you know when I set this up and when I get hold of some batteries so you guys can see what it looks like. If I've managed to set it up before this video goes up, I will like insert some photos and videos here. Um, but yeah, another really cool little purchase, something that I wouldn't have thought of. But again, that could be like a really cool little gift idea for someone, like if they've just moved into somewhere new, into their home, or like something, maybe even like a uni present, something to pop up um, and remind them of you like whilst they're at uni. I think that's super cute. So yeah, thank you very much to all of my close friends on Insta for sending over some links to these Amazon goodies. They actually did like an amazing job and I feel like they've given me some like gift in for the future and hopefully helped you some of you guys out as well but yeah hope you all have an amazing day and like this little different video let me know if there's anything else you want to see or sort of similar style where other people pick out some bits and yeah i will see you in my next video bye